We're looking at an interesting piece of kit. This is the armorer's kit for the VZ-58, the Czechoslovakian variant of the AK-47. Before anyone yells at me, the VZ-58 is not an actual AK-47. It is its own rifle, but in my opinion, it's one of the most interesting variants of the AK-47 style rifle. Um, just, you know, so much about it is different. Um, from maybe six feet away, I think most people would think of it as an AK-47 because of the general shape. Um, but, of course, once you're familiar with the AK-47, it's quite a bit different. I have it out here to illustrate what we're really looking at here is the armorer's kit. It's real heavy duty, military style box. We open it up. We've got the uh, layout, you know, when you're packing it or to check it. And then the parts list. It says something in Czechoslovakia in there. Of course it says 7.62 millimeter. We know what that is. The VZ-58. Then we've got the drawers here, or the diff three different drawers. First drawer contains some upper hand guards, lower hand guards, pistol grips, grips for the bayonet, slings, some bolt carriers, or yeah, bolt carriers, I think. We've got some folding stocks. It looks like one regular stock. We'll put that over here. Next, we've got the second tray, second drawer which has some of the smaller parts. Looks like it actually has some trunnions, a couple of magazines, lots of smaller parts that are all wrapped up. Uh, butt pads, some actual bayonets, some bolts, really neat stuff there. Then you've got one more layer underneath that's full of magazines and stocks and some more magazines. So a really interesting armorer's kit for rebuilding the, the VZ-58 and resetting up the bayonets. I'm a big fan of the bayonets. And you'll see the typical bayonet comes with this sort of Bakelite type of material. But in the armorer's kit, it came with some different colored wooden grips, which are pretty darn neat. Different sort of shade of wood, and it's got hand guards that match. So while the VZ-58 usually has this same Bakelite material on the pistol grip and on the, if it was a stock, and then on the grips, uh, hand guards. You've got the same thing here. All wood, solid wood, stocks and whatnot. Pretty interesting.